This video deals with important testing concept that is check digit. So what is check digit? It is an extra value that is added to data to ensure that original data has not been altered. That is data accuracy. Check digit is used to ascertain data accuracy. We will take one example how it works. So this is a 12 digit bank account number. So here first 11 digit are the actual bank account number and the 12th digit that is the 7 is check digit. Let us understand how this 7 arrived. It is arrived from the algorithm that is being applied to first 11 digit. For CISA exam, we need not remember how this algorithm works. This is basically for our understanding purpose. So first we add all the odd number. Then we multiply the result by 3. Again third step to add even number digit. Fourth step and fifth step. So if you apply this 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 step, the answer will be 7. So any of the number between 1 to 11, if any changes will be there, then answer will not be 7. Thus, in case if any of the digit is entered wrong, answer will not be tallied with the check digit and hence error will be detected. For CISA exam, we need to remember that check digit helps to detect transposition as well as transcription errors and to ensure data accuracy. Let us discuss some question. So in this question, our objective is to identify transposition and transcription errors. So whenever objective is to identify transposition and transcription error, our answer should be check digit. So main reason for implementing check digit as a control is to validate. This we already discussed. Check digit is used to identify transcription and transposition error, hence to ascertain data accuracy. So we need to remember when our objective is data completeness, answer should be parity bit and when our objective is data accuracy, answer should be check digit. So in the given question, check digit is implemented, hence our objective was to ascertain data accuracy. So again, an IS auditor is reviewing a process where frequency of transposition and transcription errors are very high. So again, transposition and transcription errors and our objective is to identify such errors. So in such scenario, our answer should be check digit. Transposition and transcription error answer should be check digit. An IS auditor is reviewing EDA application and observed that validation at its check digit has been implemented. So what is the purpose of check digit? Already discussed to identify transposition as well as transcription error. Thanks for watching. For more such video, please visit datainfosec.com.